In this quick tutorial, I will show you how to program your robot to use an ultrasonic sensor. Connect the orange USB cable to your robot and the computer. Plug in a battery to your robot. Open EZC version 4 for Cortex. Click Open Project from the menu and select Samples. There are many sample programs that you can use to make complex programs. You are looking for ultrasonic test. When you find it, double click and double click on the program. The sample program will help you test your sensor. Below the Vario box are instructions as to where to plug in the two sensor wires into your robot. Plug the input wire into digital number 11 on your robot. Plug the output wire into digital number 1 on your robot. Then connect the sensor to the front of your robot using nuts and bolts. With your sensor attached, press F7 to download the program. When the program downloads, the terminal window is opened and text scrolls across the screen. The text is showing you the distance in inches of objects in front of the sensor. It is best to test the value using a flat surface like a textbook or wall. Move the textbook back and forth in front of the sensor and see how the value changes. Next, I will show you how to use the sensor and the motors together. We will modify the sample program. If you haven't already done so, open up the ultrasonic test program. Next, select project, then standalone project type, and select autonomous only. On the left, from the program flow heading, drag in an if and place it below the weight. Add a variable of ultrasonic, add an operator of greater than or equal to, and type in the number 10. Then from the left, drag in motors and place them inside the IF and make the motor values drive your robot forward. From the program flow heading on the left, drag in an ELSE and place it below the IF. Then drag in motor modules that will make your motor stop. You have created a program that if the ultrasonic gives a value that is greater than or equal to 10, the robot will drive forward, or else the robot will stop. The ultrasonic sensor is a variable in this program, and because the program is in a while loop, this program will repeat forever. When your program is ready, hit F7 to download the program to your computer. Troubleshoot the program as needed, and if you need help, see your teacher. Your last step is to modify your program so after the robot stops, the robot backs up, turns, and continues to drive straight.